Yes! On the Arcanist Owl, yes. It could be that if it has some kind of buff spell or something, but hopefully not. <laughs> okay. We gotta get a couple of cards here. Usually, when someone plays Thassa's Oracle in their deck, it's because they draw so many cards that you just win with it because you have no cards in your deck. But that's not what we're gonna do. We're gonna use this in the intended way. The way Wizards intended it, maybe. <laughs> We're gonna do it, because you have so much devotion that we can win on the spot. Of course, if you haven't seen Thassa's Oracle, when it ends Bad Feed, you look at the top X cards of your library, where X is your devotion to blue, and then if X is great, then or equal to the number of cards in your library, you win the game. So we need something like 44, 50 something devotion. Usually we've drawn a couple of cards, so we don't need to have 60, but like 40, 44, something like that. So how are we gonna get so much devotion? Well, we're gonna clone something, and that something's gonna be the Orchestrist Owl. Because of the mana cost. So it has uh, white slash blue mana cost, which means that it increases the devotion to blue and to white, which we're both gonna use in this deck. So, we are gonna play Reverend Hoplite, where it creates a number 1-1 one, one white human soul creature tokens equal to your devotion to white, and this of course gives a lot of devotion to white, so we play this after the Arcanist Owl. And then we Mystic Reflect on our Arcanist Owl to create an insanely amount of Arcanist Owls, and then we can just win with Thassa's Oracle. Alternatively, if we don't have Thassa's Oracle, we can play a run of Daxos and get a lot of life points because we can also target Reverend Hoplite with the Mystic Reflection when we play Reverend Hoplite just to gain a lot of life. But we're probably not gonna use that. Yeah, just in, in, in an emergency, we could do that. Uh, other than that, it's just things which fetch the combo, right? So we have uh, Raven's Warning, which can go with the sideboard, pick up all the combo pieces. Nyx Lotus gives a lot of mana. Thassa is amazing with Orcanist Owl, because Orcanist Owl immediately enables Thassa to become a creature, and Thassa can of course bounce the Orcanist Owl uh, there and back again any number of times. Last pull Mimic to copy the Orcanist Owl and the Reverend Hoplite. And that is pretty much deck, let's jump into the game. Oh, 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 oh. It's looking good. Looking good, everybody. Looking good, this hair looking... Ah, you fine. I would give it a... Four out of five. <laughs> Is that more than a five? No, that's just fine. In my world, that's just fine. If we'd also had um, the Mystic Reflection, then would be a bit of five. Out of five. But I didn't have it, so. Okay, well, we are assembling the Combonaires, as they say. Mm hmm. Do we play Raven's Warning? Or do we play Shloon Division so we can play Arcanist Owl next turn? Nah, nah, that's what I think we do. This guy is just gonna play more clerics. I know this. I know this guy. So we're gonna just foretell this thing. He's gonna play another cleric. We're gonna schnoon his clerics. Because if I play this, I will be in this awkward position where I need to kill my own bird. I don't like killing my own bird. I don't like it at all. Okay, cleric of life's bond though. Smacking in, sure. So we'll first doom scar. Taking care of business here. And then you down. Ooh, now we have Arcanist Owl and Glassful Mimic on it. That, that is building up a lot of devotion, honestly. A lot of devotions. Luminarch Aspirin. And, Speaker of the Havans. Okay. With Plus Counter on him. Well, I think we just want to explore. Explore a little bit. Okay, that. Be useful at some point. At some point. Uh, okay, well, we'll put down you happers. I think. Snappity happers, snappity happers. Okay, so some devotion there for the Reverend Top Light. If we draw into that card which copies, I think we're just gonna create five owls. That's pretty good. <laughs> and also, that's enough devotion to scry a lot of cards. It's not enough to win, though. It's not enough to win. So maybe we need to go bigger. Even if final card, the Mystic Reflection. Ooh, Luminarch Aspirin. Fast counter on the Hallowed Priest. Okay, so he's not smacking in. Ooh, Ooh he's not smacking in, huh? Well, hmm. Question is what to go for now. We could go for another Arcanist Owl. I think we go for both the Owl and we go for a Raven's Warning because now we have. Some things here. Ooh, a Daxus. That's a two-way to Daxus. I mean, we have to take it, right? We have to take it, okay? And this. 
Dax is getting pretty big. I think we're smacking with this out. Badank. Badunk. And uh, I'm feeling pretty good about this. This Reverend top line is gonna create a lot of dudes. If it ducks us plus Reverend, but we don't want to go off yet. We want to go off with this when we have the reflection, right? So, okay. Start target that creature. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. And then he's still. Oh! <laughs> go play this turn. No, we can't. Ah, oh, okay. We need to foretell you first. Okay, so foretell this. And I guess we play a Daxosian. It is pretty ballers big. We don't want to play the Thasa. We could probably win with the Thasa before too long here. I think we just smack in with this to draw the card. That might also keep him at bay here. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh wait, I could have played it. If I'd attacked him with the bird first. Oh, okay. Well. Hopefully he doesn't kill the owl. He probably kills the owl. Oh, it's a heartless act. He's just killing that owl. Oh no! No! Or he kills Daxos. Good reason. Cosmo selects it. That is perfect. <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Okay! Okay, I think we're. I think it's gonna happen. I think it is going to happen, okay? Put the plus gun on there. He's still not coming in. I don't know. He should probably put a count on this and attack it or something. Oh, okay, so life one there. My turn! Okay. So we need to be a little bit careful so I don't mess up the combo. What do we want on top, though? Another one of these, probably. <laughs> okay. Full control mode. Uh, you there. Yes. Yes! Response to that dead trigger, sir. No, no, wait, 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 wait. no, no, no. We're gonna get owls. We're gonna get owls. We could get a lot of hoplites, though. We could get a lot of hoplites, like an insane amount, but we're gonna go for this. Yes? <laughs> no! No, that was a doll! No! We were just getting started. It's just me, we're just getting started with the devotion. How much devotion did we have? We had like seven, uh, eight times four. Eight times four, 32. How many cards we have left in the library? Ooh, maybe we could have won the turn after with Thassa. Maybe, because Thassa would have given us two more. 34. And maybe we could have gotten some more devotion somewhere. I don't know. Oh! Oh, that would have been so cool. That would have been so cool. Daphne. <laughs> Story of my life, I guess. Build this pop. Yep. Well, we are gonna. Scry the scries. I don't think we need that ladder. I think we need something which gives devotion so we can get the Nyx Lotus doing stuffs. Never seen this card, by the way. And boast and gets plus two plus zero. Interesting. Uh, I think we just go for the Doom Scar for Teller. And if it's just attacking with this and buffing, I'm probably not just Doom Scarring one pop here. I think that's gonna be a little bit brutal, I think. A little bit too brutal for my fists. I like more the subtle bits. Snowing. Raid bombardment, or maybe. Maybe I have to do it. Okay. Uh, hmm. Or maybe we just Raven's Warning and check out his hand. Could be a way of doing things. Yeah, I think we just do that. Raven's Warning, get some life back, get a Burnio, and then he needs to deal with the Burnio, or we draw a Cardio. A Cardio. <laughs> Does that mean there's something else? No. Nothing that I've ever engaged with, at least. <laughs> In my life. Okay, four manas. Gonna get something down there. That they ground, sir. Scorch McGurk. McGurk! Oh, McGurk! Look at this. Oh, he gets haste! But he doesn't have haste himself. Um, yes, first strike, though. So, nah, no haste. We'll just take it. We will just take it. Smack in with Alberto. Hmm. We got the hand. You have this, sir. Calamity Bear. Wow, Craven Hulk. Oh, sorry. Sir, senor, okay. Thassa is really cool, but it's not doing anything for a while. So, let's clear the bird. Does this work with this? No, it doesn't. Does this work with this? No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Sure. 
<laughs> you don't need to combo everything, Chris. I know. I know, but kind of kind of need to combo everything. Alice is not as cool. It's a little bit cool. Not as cool. Um Think about the Doom Scar next turn, right? So we put down you. We keep that there, because that's combo. Nyx Lotus, which doesn't produce any manas yet, but at some point it will. It will grow into a formidable force at some point. He's gonna deal double damage though with this. With that Calamity Bear. Deal 8 wrecking damage, that's a lot of damage. But then he's gonna lose both of them. And we have a lot of life games, so I think we're fine. I think we're fine. The Doom Scario. And do we Shloondy? Oh, we can't Shloondy. Can this produce any mana? No, it can't. Uh, we can put down the Ondo's Inversion, but on the other hand, we might need the Ondo's Inversion. I think we put down the Glass Bomb Magma Castle down, actually. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Because we might have to go for the Storm on non permit. I am hoping we won't have to, but okay. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Can we now... Let's see here. If we Shloon Divisions... Into another Shloon Divisions... And then we Shloon Divisions... <laughs> into another Shloon Divisions... No... Actually, what I think I'll go for... I think I'll go for the Ondo Inversion and play it as a land. Actually. <laughs> Might be weird, but then we can uh, see get Restoration next turn. <laughs> this next load is not doing anything. The Devotion deck with zero Devotion. Not fantastic, we'll say. Let's see, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So one of playing this also. Might come in handy. Might actually come in handy. Um, yeah, I mean, we might have to do that. Get rid of his Bombardment and his Magda. We lose a Nyx Lotus. Or... Ah, we gotta take three from that or whatever. I don't think it's gonna matter. Just draw. Just draw. And then we get down this, and now we're gonna get devotion, everybody. Now we get, now we have the owl. The owl is here to save the day, hopefully. We're gonna take a little bit of damage here from this guy. Okay, great. Bang, we go down to six, which is completely fine. This, though, will enable Nyx Shlotus. Okay. We are gonna get some manas here. <laughs> Maybe you say you need to. Okay, well, we're gonna pay to eight, pay eight here. We're gonna go full control mode. We're gonna put you down. Gonna auto pay. Gonna resolve. Gonna mystic reflection. Yes. On the Arcanist Owl, yes. He could be dead if he has some kind of buff spell or something, but hopefully not. <laughs> okay. We gotta get a couple of cards here. Sure. Uh, Owl. I don't think we need more, though, to be... Okay, well, we're taking it. Because <laughs> why not, I say, okay? Uh, the Conquest Death, sure. Actually, if... Oh my god! <laughs> 45 Daxos! Okay. Oh my god, 44 loyalty Thassa, yeah, sure, yep, 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 uh, ah, decline, we start declining these, we don't even have enough mana to play all these anyways. <laughs> okay, no, no, we want the Thassa, we want to win properly, oh my god, look at those oracles. Has a lot of tap lands and no board wipes and only Thassa's Oracle. Probably should mulligan this hand, say. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, it's kind of got worse, <laughs> weirdly enough. Weirdly enough. No, 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 we should division is a land. Okay. Oh, well. Still bad, but. Still the battle will make it happen somehow, some way. I think we'll ship this. And uh, draw a land and we'll be good, maybe? If we don't draw a land though, we're gonna be in Trubul, I think. Trubul. The land of Trubul. That's, I come from the land of Trubul. Oh my god. Two want a card in that there library, sir. 
Sir Senor Senoritas. That's a lot of cards. Mm -hmm. Azusa, lost but seeking. More lands? Two more. Come on. You have to get maximum value. And it does. It's actually kind of nice if you go Azusa and you go first like this. Actually, like, think about it. Turn 3 Azusa. Turn 4... Um, what is that card called? The thing which draws you cards and you scry equal to the snow or whatever it was. That's that's pretty good. You got that off. Because then you also get essentially all the cards that you've lost. Not lost. But the cards that you put down as lands, you kind of get back. Don't like that. That would be a really good opener, honestly. Azusa, what's that uh, card called even? It's called something. I know that's called something. I know my grand. A grand of main foresight. <laughs> what are you saying, Chris? A man of great foresight. I've coined the expression. <laughs> I think. <laughs> I think I've heard anyone else say it, though. Uh, so, I'm always smacking. Let me check out his hand there. Well, what got there? You got a 30 lid? With some Ugans or something? No, life goes on. Sure. Life goes on without you. I think we, here's what I do. We pay the life points. Why am I not playing this more, by the way? Nick's Lotus this is an amazing card. We <laughs> get to play it with Arcanist Owl. Such an amazing card. Because next time we can play Arcanist Owl and we can play Fasa. That's pretty good. That's pretty value. Value, value. That's what I'm trying to say. That is value, value. Wait, shouldn't you have activated this? No, it ends up having tapped. Okay, so I thought we could do this, then get the counters back and activate it again. Oh, but he had a land, so he could have done this now. Oh, he should have activated his Fertilid first. Sir, I would have done the same. I would have not thought about it, but... But, but, but... Okay. So, the problem here is we want to play the Arcanist Owl, which means that we need to put an enchantment on top or something. Else we're not going to pick it up. Um, or a creature. We're gonna go Thunderous Snapper, actually. Or Resolute Raider. Or a Daxos. Maybe we Daxos. Right? Daxos is kinda cool. Kinda ballers. Put you down, Arcanist Owl. He's gonna pick up my Daxos. My Daxos. Yes, my Daxos. And then uh, with Thassa. Blue. Why did I say blue? Oh, because I used Nyx Lotus. <laughs> like, why is this character saying blue for no reason? Blue! <laughs> okay, and I think I can put this Shlundi down the land. No attack, Lerunus. You go there and back again. Could also untap the Nyx Lotus with this. We don't have any instants. Man, I need to play this card more. It's so fun to play with, getting like a million gazillion mana, sorry. Uh, hmm, I mean, I guess Raven's warning. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, no acid. I mean, no acids. We got so many. I mean, no acids. You know what the expression I mean, as it means, Chris? Yes, I know. <laughs> because you're not using it in the correct way. I know. I know. Okay, okay. And uh, life goes on. Life goes on. <laughs> Eight life points. Sure. Oh, we drew the other ducks that we had in deck. Interesting. Uh, here's what I think we'll do, though. Well, Daxosian, white, and uh, that's gonna be something at some point. It's gonna, it's gonna take a little bit of time here to work up. We're gonna work up some steam here. With some raven with some warnings. And slowly, we're going to accrue the lead. You have an instant spell, sir? Sir Eric? That is not life goes on. Another card. Have I ever played life goes on in a deck? Ever. I've played a lot of weird cards. I don't think I've played this card. There's a pretty nice way of gaining 8 life, though. You want to gain very, very fast. Like, if you play this with... Ooh, we could actually turn two activate the cleric if you want to. 
if you really want to. You really want to do, you could be my lover. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, Yeah, find the best nest, the plant, plant, the plant. Man, if I have some kind of board right now, an Ugin or something. What does, what do we do if we have the Ugin? I mean, play Reverend the Hoplite. And Vaxos. Or Shnunim. Shnunim McDunim. Ah, create the Birdio. Gain some life pointios. And I can smack him with you and smack him with you. Unless he has, ooh, some kind of trick here with Dorio. Goes down to 18. And that Arcanist Owl. I think he's gonna go there and back again. Ooh. Get some more life points, okay. That's not matters, but that's fine. Next time we're gonna get the double drawer from the Raven's Warning. Unless he concedes, which I hope he doesn't. Really hope he doesn't, because we haven't even gotten started yet. Haven't even gotten started. And this guy probably runs it again in his 200 card pile. I mean, I would be surprised if he doesn't. Also, he has only basics. No, he doesn't have only which speaks of him maybe having the card. Ooh, maybe that's where we got uh, ranked. Uh, what's it called? The guy which owns a plant for every basic land. He could be playing that. He has the colors for it, and he certainly has the basics for it. Okay. With the wall, again, a life point. And I guess smacking with you and you and you. And see, where he blocks there. Blocks it, Birdio. The Orion, sure. He's down to 11, and. What does he have in his hand? We're gonna get some life points. A okay, Fabled Passage. And we want to go off in the most glorious of fashion, so we're not really doing that right now. We don't want to play Reverend Hoplite yet. Now, for tell you. Tell you. Sure, play both my letters. Planes, down, and enter. And Arcanist Owl, they're back again. Pick up some more best. This is just a good combo. But also, another card which nobody plays anymore. When this card was released, I was like, it's broken. It's so good. I mean, I guess we had Agent of Treachery back then, so I guess it actually was broken back then. But the same point. Why is nobody playing this card? Kind of good. It's good with Yorian also. No, 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 no. Sand for champions. I mean, this is good though. Double Shlune. I'm complaining here, but I'm complaining for no reason. Which is, in most cases, when you are complaining in life. I don't know if this is true for only me, but it's, it's usually just, you know, for no good reason. I mean, if you have food, you have a roof. I mean, even if you don't have a roof, you're kind of fine. If you have food and you don't have some weird disease. You're kind of fine. You're, good. You're doing good. <laughs> You're doing amazing. And even if you have a weird disease, you may be doing good also, depending on what the disease is. Not the you die in one second disease, because then you're not fine, I guess, but... <laughs> then I guess bad luck. If you call the you die in one second disease, then, uh, I mean, you're already gone, so... <laughs> if, you, if you've caught that disease, you wouldn't still be here to listen to me speak, but... Okay. Dream Stauka. Rock and Maka Founders! Rock and Donors! Born Bash Mentor. It's just... All these guys are just <laughs> giving me lessons in cards I don't know about. Weird uncommons. Uh, when it cost your first spell during your opponent turn, just one damage on the target. Interesting. I don't know why this is so popular. I think you get that guy for free or something in something. Be my guess why it's so popular. Or it's just because it's amazing. That might be the case. Might certainly be. But... Uh, you missed? Can't you pick up creatures? No artifact or enchantment, I thought. Oh, and this is an artifact himself. I thought it was a creature. Oh, ah, okay. Well, I. Yeah, I should learn my own cards, I guess. That would be smirky, eh? That'd be freaking smirky. Uh, I think I'll probably find a board wipe with this, right? But if you don't find a board wipe, it's fine. Come on, we always have the board wipe. Are you kidding me? We always have it. Take it on. Why not? 
This guy seems to be on the creature plan anyways. Pays four manas. Brushwag. Brush. Okay, goes in. That's a lot of damage though. Actually, <laughs> my duck. Well, any haste we are dead. I mean, any like big haste, I guess. Not not the small tiny ones. That's gonna work. And Raven's warning. Up to eight. We have life game uh, capabilities though in this thing. So I'm not overly worried. What is your name, by the way? Oi, Ui, Trev, Q. Did he just press random letters because he didn't care? Because that's what it looks like, sir. Sir, you're making no sense again. Birdio, smack his face. Birdio, you have a mission. Mission like you've never had one before. Smack his face! Take away that one life game that he got from his rugged island. Take it away! Take it away! Ah! Oh. Okay, what's in your hand there, sir? Before you grab one, Q, one, two, three. Well, we could have been in trouble. Luckily, it didn't have anything big to <laughs> Three Unleash Fury. I uh, could have been a huge dude, though. I love that you're living the dream, buddy. <laughs> and this face, also. This stern face. And three Unleash Fury. Problem. <laughs> and then you know about him having three Unleash Fury. Unless it's a really good haster. Gonna be problematic for him, I think. Gonna be difficult. Uh, let's see, a Mystic Reflection, I mean. And... Let us see, let us see. Down the Thassa. Oh wait, Mist well, we don't have any part of the combo. <laughs> we have Orcanist now, that's all. That's all we have. That's all we have. We're gonna also stay on the blue cursor. Right? This <laughs> I love this, the combination of this face. And <laughs> three Unleashed Fury in the hand. <laughs> it just looks so good. <laughs> I can just imagine this being his real face in real life right now. <laughs> it's sitting there playing. <laughs> oh, I don't know why I found that so funny. Okay. Oh, this guy's trampled. This guy's trampled. Oh, we didn't have anything in the graveyard also. Because you didn't play anything. So. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait. I should play Birth there. Should have played Birth, but I didn't. In boot. In boot. One of the chain. <laughs> Still the space. He's sitting on three unleashed here. <laughs> it's just so sad. <laughs> oh my god. I need to stop finding this so funny. I don't know why I find it so funny. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh no, no, what that? No tax. It still has the possibility for haste. Still has this face. He's still giving me this face with all these unleashed furies. Oh, I have to look away. <laughs> I don't think I can look at it. Okay, leave kill Avenger. Yep. And this guy gets okay. And the damage equal to its power to target player or planes. That could be dangerous. That could be dangerous, sir. Uh, I think we'll have to clear the board. And I have to not look at his face because it makes me giggle every time. Okay, well, let's go. Put down this. Uh, yeah, put down this. Tell it! Still don't have anything returning with this. Uh, okay. Okay, it's fine. Whew. Yeah. That thing's not doing anything. Great. Well, can you find something now? Sir Arkan Stahl, or could you triple, triple double the power on my owl there, maybe? Would be pretty nice. Ooh, also, yeah, that makes Tasa come alive. Probably should have done that earlier. Probably should have. Okay, Raven's Bwanning. Cool. And what do we get there on top? We get a combo piece. That would be sweet. That would be really sweet. Ah, oh, that's kind of a combo piece. I think we're better. My cards were left 38, so yeah, we're done. We're kind of far off. Oh, <laughs> having the devotion. Okay, get the bird. Smack it with Tosa. I, I still can't look at his face. I still can't do it. Okay, 15. Yep, there I'm back again. Mr. Owl. Mm. And. Oh, wait, now we can't pick up the Tosa. 
Whatever, whatever, whatever. I think we got him anyways, even without the combo, but... I would love the combo, but... But, 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 but... Does anyone feel like playing Unleashed Fury after that game? I don't have an itch for that card after seeing that game, I will admit. I'm really not feeling Unleashed Fury right now. Okay. Fall... Falle Knight. Falle Knight. Sounds like something else on. Uh, let's see here. Do we just put it on Tap the Snappers? I think so. And then we'll let us, let us. Fallen Knight. You, you could have had another end there. Fallen Knight. Or you could have a Chaos. And an end. <laughs> You're missing a lot of letters, so that's what Brian said. Okay. Let us, let us. Thanks. Tapped. I'm gonna cross the library, okay? Just slightly above 60, just to balance out the mana a little bit. Make it have the perfect ratio, maybe. All a night. Okay. Nothing. Huh? Well, 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 we organized Owl. And we. Organized Owl again. Seemed like a pretty good play. A good play to me. It's just me. Is this card like kind of like a fine card? Like what is playing it? Fine card. No! Oh, he's gonna give it another indestructible and kill it, isn't he? Or he's gonna kill the wall? That made no sense. But sure. <laughs> Why did you kill the wall? Why did you kill the wall there? A very interesting decision, must say, but why? <laughs> Fallen Knight. Why did he kill the wall there? It didn't... He had three more, more snow farmers. Yeah, that did not make any sense. Okay. Ooh, we went for this instead of this. That was smart, right? Because if we went for this... It wouldn't have been good. Because he would have come back. <laughs> I just did more. And more and more and more. Keep piling them on, I say. Keep piling them on. Back in space. We just kill them with owls. Because they're so good. They have an owl party. Okay, he's getting a forest, though. He's actually playing a legit deck, I like. Like Jorn. This is a good Jorn Blizzard Brawl. Probably the best fight card ever printed, maybe. Uh, I'll be smacking with these guys. Schmagen. Uh What else do we do? We want that Mystic Reflection to do something at some point. Mm. Can we play this? No, we can't. Can we play a defensive one? Defensive one. And... Uh, I think we even play life. Just to put this... On the sidelines. So if we live the dreamer, if we hit the combo, we just beat him with Arcanist Owls. I feel like this guy is looking like he could have a good deck. Ooh, going Clack Source! Oh, now I regret playing <laughs> Elspeth Conquer's F on just random. No oh, no, I don't! <laughs> Not at all! Uh, okay, well, full control mode. Yeah, all pay. Or do we create more hoplites? That is the question, because we don't have anything really we can do with the 1 million Orkney styles, but... Uh, but again! <laughs> but again, it's 1 million Orkney styles. I think we'll take it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, ooh, that's a good one. I think we I think we have kind of a lot of mana from that thing now. Oh, we missed like three times also. Okay, Raven's warning. Uh, Thassa, yes. For that, okay. Nothing there. It's <laughs> warning. Ah, uh, right, the warning. And both of my letters, sure. Daxos, that's a nice one. Ooh, that's the Elspeth. Ah, uh, shabby, we smack it. <laughs> what we ship them? Uh, a couple of Ravens warnings, maybe. And both of my letters, letters. Uh, we don't need one more owl. 
I mean, I, I doubt it. Maybe we do, but... Board wipes or something. Would that be sweet to find a Thassa there? I mean, well, we couldn't have found a Thassa. Because it's not an enchantment, so we can't find it that way. Think about this Nyx Lotus, though, coming down there. A lot of mass. We have a lot of owls. Ow! <laughs> you play another Warring Clicks? Okay. Which one are you gonna keep? Why did you play another? Okay. I think our army of owls is gonna block him. Yep. He be fallen now. Fallen knight. Oh! I think this guy probably played a really fun deck. What I think. But, oh my god, oh, by the way. <laughs> Everybody! Everybody! Look at this! <laughs> Oh wait, why did I play this first? Oh no! Why did I play the Daxos first? Oh, that would have been so glorious, but I didn't do it. Oh, oh, everybody! Yeah! I don't know why I have a, like a Daxit Boys revival kind of thing going on. Revival? Did they ever go away? No. No, they did not. Not in my heart. They went away. Yeah, still as amazing as the ones were. 241 cards. Okay, but the Maletus Letus. Does have Yorian though. So this is very much fine. Um, hmm. uh, sure. That. Pass. Dapper, dapper, passionate passers. A Yorion deck. 250 cards. I mean, we're not middling this game. That's for sure. Best in Bastion of Riemann Bronze. That is maybe gonna be amazing for you. 5,000 turns. Oh my god! I love the owl. I love the owl, I love the owl, I love the owl. Do we, are we gonna Doom Scar soon? Maybe. Who knows? I'll put them in the hat. I will just explore possibilities. I still remember that. I mean, he could have anything. Honestly. He white, black, 250 cards. Didn't like it. Okay. There we go, Spirit. You play a second spell, you create a white spirit creature token. Okay. That seems dangerous, huh? Uh, I think what we are gonna do is... It's gonna owl. Owl! Yes, 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 yes! Yes, that Lotus! A Lotus has been known to be kind of good in this deck. Maybe there's more than one. But, I mean, we can't use more than one, but... Well, no, yeah, we can probably find it then. Probably. Choof! Ooh, the Yorian in hand. Two manas left over there. And but the Orcus Owl is holding him back, so that's good. I guess we just Lotus. And we just passed on. Passed. Ooh. Mm -mm -mm. That is some delicious Dr. Pepper. I mean, it's always. The thing with Dr. Pepper is it's delicious in the morning. <laughs> the breakfast Dr. Pepper is as delicious as the. <laughs> Before go to sleep, Dr. Pep. No! <laughs> okay. Alright, you kill it. You did it, buddy. You we'll kill that thing. You snowed it pretty good. I'll say, you snowed it pretty good. Poison the cup. There we go, it's a lantern. Oh. Snowing, so I will lose it. That is okay. They're all gonna lose some life points, but on the other hand. On the other hand, might lose this now because I am so greedy. But just no, missed really. Okay, well, take that there and back again. Could also just throw cards to the left, I guess. I guess. Else, but Oh, is he plays? Is he playing the like the terror grid? Do I have your library kind of style? Though? That's a possibility, I guess. Okay. I mean, it's surely activating this. As to this point. And I think I'm fine going down lower. I mean, we kind of lose four from the Bastion of Riemann Bronze. So that's gonna be... Baby. But on the other hand... At some point we'll find Daxos, right? Oh, yes, win. Oh! It's kind of cool though. Yorian plus land. I've never seen anyone play that before. Okay. I go there and back again. 
Uh, we gotta go down low, I think. Ooh, no! It, <laughs> she comes back as that terror grid. Oh, didn't think about it. Didn't think about it. That's kind of amazing, though. Kind of amazing. Let's see here. So we can play... Let's see, we can get four blue from this if we want to. Which is kind of amazing. Wait, can we win this turn? And we win. How many cards in the library? 44. I don't think this is gonna be enough to win. Even with Mystic Reflection. I don't think so. So I think we need to stall for one more turn. Get things off her. Unfortunately. You are gonna take a lot of damage though. Like a lot of it. When I'm gonna sacrifice a non token, we're not gonna sacrifice anything though. Here's what we do. We have to, yeah. Take out five blue. We snoon the board with the Doomscar. We're gonna take a lot of damage from this Bastion. Like a lot of it. Seven, yep. Yeah. We go down low. Uh, what were you planning on doing with all this mana? You ask? <laughs> I don't know exactly yet. Uh, we foretell you! Uh, actually what I probably should have done, I should have taken out white even though it was le one less, because then I could Elspeth this first and then board wipe. <laughs> that would have been so much better. That would have been so much better! Oh, I feel sad I didn't do that. Okay. Really, really sad. Oh well. Two, we're down to three. If you have another lantern, you might just be owning us very much right now. Okay, three miles. Telling it. Rankle, no! Oh, because of my dingusness! Friendly neighbor Chris, where is he? Is he to the left, to the left? To the, to the right, to the right! <laughs> this time, it's uh, your friendly pirate, Chris. Because he has an eye patch or something, I don't know. I just want to say thank you, by the way, to all the members that joined, the latest members, which are Daily Van. Sounds like a German newspaper or something. Daily Banner. <laughs> something. The daily news about a guy named Banner. <laughs> and let's see here. Steve Earth. Thank you so much for joining. And also, Andrew Holmes. Thank you. And see you tomorrow. And you are? It's -a me, the YouTube algorithm. And well, what are you doing here? I'm just here to take all the views. No, the, those are my views. Oh, I can explain to you, senor. You see, you have subs zero uh, percent and non subs a uh, hundred percent. That's why you can take all your views. <laughs> I guess it's time that you uh, check out a little. Nothing down there.